What's up? It's your man Axel right here. Um, I'm going to talk to you about TMC. Uh, it's the company I drive for. Um, when I first started, uh, when I first got my, uh, well, before I got my CDL, I went to this company. Uh, I'm not going to mention the name, but uh, I did uh, schooling with them. And the thing they did is the way they taught us was different, way, way different than TMC. Um, the only thing they did is backing, um, yeah, back backing, offset, and what was the other thing? Backing, offset. And, um, oh, parallel. And, uh, that's it. It was that every day, every day, every day, every day. All right. So when we went to test, um, they never taught us how to, like, if you're, when you're doing an offset and, you know, you're, um, you're off, how to fix that problem. You know, that that was one thing that they didn't do. That's why I failed the test. Um, they never taught us all the things. It was, it, it was just you get set up and then you back up and they told us all to follow their instructions and, you know, you're going to be in. Well, when I went to test, I didn't, I wasn't um, set up right. So I was off. And uh, when when I tried to back it in, I you know touched the cone, so it uh, it didn't go well for me. So I failed the test. All right, so I'm like, you know what? Um, they called me in the office, and they're like, well, um, they gave some guys uh, a third chance, but they only gave me a second chance, which is great because I went with TMC. And uh, now when I went here to TMC, when, when uh, they uh, got me in, uh, they're, um, they teach you everything. They teach you, you know, how to back up the right way, how to uh, get in a parking spot, how to fix your problems. Uh, when, you're, um, when you're doing an offset, they teach you how to fix the problem. Um, some schools, they don't, you know, some schools, they say, we're just going to show you what you're going to do in the test. And uh, that, I don't think that's right because, you know, what's going to happen if you're, you go and do your test and you know, what, what happened to me that I was off. And then when I started backing up, I'm like, I hit the cone. Well, this place uh, was TMC. Uh, if I get if if I was off, my instructor would say, "Hey, come out!" Like I'm, you know, and it would start telling me what to do, and showing me how to correct that problem. That's the good thing about TMC, man. That's that's awesome. Um, they focus on you a lot, and uh, they're one of the best trainers. Um, my, uh, load securement, they have, uh, classes for load securement and they teach you how to, what to do, you know, all, all the straps and how to use your straps, how to throw your straps, how to, uh, the chains, all the stuff about chains and, you know, all the load securement crap. And, uh. And I've seen a lot of companies, I've helped a lot of people that they uh, go to school with their company only, you know, but they don't teach them the right way. And when they start doing their load securement, I've seen some guys where, man, they, they don't know, they don't have a clue what they're doing, a clue what they're doing. And, you know, I always go there and I help them out and I tell them how to do it. Um, which, 
you know, I don't mind. As long as they don't keep me, you know, as long as they don't keep me, on, um, keep me there for a while. But yeah, that's, that's TMC. Um, it's a really good company. I do recommend that company. Um, one thing I really like about it is that they, um, let's say you're sick, all right, you're sick and you can't drive. It's been like two times that's happened to me. I've been really, really sick and with a, I was in, I was in a Houston and I had a big ass fever. It was a hundred degrees there. I was in the in the bunk. I was um, laying down with all my blankets on top of me, and I was freezing <laughs> when it was a hundred degrees outside. Um, I couldn't walk. I couldn't walk, and I had to drop off that load that day. And I um, I went to the truck stop. And I could barely walk. Uh, I went there and I took some pills. I bought some pills. And, and I'm like, man, I can't drive. Um, so I called my fleet manager. And I told him, hey, you know, I'm, I'm really sick. I'm really bad. He's like, you know what? Don't drive. If you think you can't drive, don't drive. Uh, it's just, it's not worth it. You know, it's not worth um, it's better to be late, you know, on your load than to get in an accident, um, and lose everything, you know, and, the, and I've heard some companies where they're like, you know what, take some pills, suck it up and, you know, drive. I've heard those companies, um... And then this other time I was I was driving and I did I have <laughs> I had a I had a I had a bad cold and a, again another fever. And um when I got on the phone with my fleet manager he was like what's wrong cuz you know my voice was like barely understand me. Like oh I got a cold and I'm I'm like really really sick. I was like you know what um, drop this off and go immediately to a truck stop. So I went there. I'm like, got to the truck stop and, and he's like, wait till tomorrow. So then, yeah, I, I waited the next morning. I took some pills. Uh, the next morning I, you know, I was feeling a little bit better and he's like, you know, how you're feeling? And I told him how I was feeling. Like, can you drive? I'm like, oh yeah, I, I I feel a little bit better than yesterday. I was dying, but it you know it took it took me like fourteen hours and a couple of pills, and I finally got better. Um, and you know they they do they do really do they care about you, they, you know. They don't want to lose their their um. They don't want to lose their. Um, us, you know, uh, they don't, they don't want us to get in an accident. They don't want. Sorry, I got a flat tire, uh, so I'm waiting for um someone to come and fix my tire. Yeah. You know? So yeah, that's that's pretty much. About uh, TMC. Um, let's see what else. It's a really good company. Uh, man, they, they do teach you everything. They do teach you um, a lot of good things. It's really good. Um, man, I've, I've really seen some companies where some guys, they don't know what they're doing. Uh, yeah. And you're home every week. Every every weekend you're you're home. You know, if you want, you're home. If you wanna just drive the 
you know, a couple of more weeks and you could drive it. Yeah. Um so yeah, that's that's one thing you could do. Peace. Alright, so yeah, that's uh that's about it. Um if I think of something else I'll you know, I'll keep you guys posted. Um Make sure you like and subscribe to my page. Peace out.